A senior Hamas official said on Sunday that the terrorist organization will not implement a long-term truce with Israel for the time being. According to top Hamas terrorist Mahmoud al-Zahar, the offer was not canceled but was being postponed because al-Zahar claims there is no one to speak with about the proposal on the Israeli side. Al-Zahar said a long-term truce was a possibility that may be developed in the future. The Hamas long-term truce offer was first made by the organization's late spiritual advisor, Ahmed Yassin, who suggested that Hamas undertake a 20-year-long ceasefire without recognizing Israel's right to exist in return for an Israeli withdrawal from lands captured in the 1967 Six-Day War. Yassin advocated the ceasefire under the pretext of Islamic history, in which Muhammad made a ceasefire agreement with the tribe of Quraysh who ruled Mecca, so that the Prophet could train and arm enough soldiers to finally conquer Islam's holiest city. Al-Zahar's remarks came a day after Hamas leader Ismail Haniya said his government had agreed to accept a Palestinian state that followed the 1967 borders and to offer Israel a long-term hudna or truce if Israel recognized the Palestinians' national rights.